not my dearest problem. Tsubaba has responded to Charlie Boy. Hey guys, welcome to Not Just Okay News. I am Bella Rose Okoji. In a viral video that went around, Charlie Boy was seen calling out Tsubaba for backing out of a protest that held earlier this year. Tsubaba, in response, granted an interview to a newspaper house where he said, The only thing I have to say about the protest is I am not Nigeria's problem. I don't understand why Charlie Boy is calling me out. He should talk to the people who are Nigeria's problem. That is all I have to say about the protest. Yes, sir. In the same vein, Pato Ranking has called out Mr. Easy over his claims of popularizing the Ghanaian sound in the Nigerian music industry. In a recent radio interview, Pato Ranking said it is false for Mr. Easy to say he started that kind of music because he did not help me sing my hit song, My Woman, which is the biggest Afrobeat song in the Caribbean. I did it all by myself and I do not agree with his statement. I think it is wrong. Hmm. <laughs> It is call out season in the Nigerian music industry undoubtedly because there is yet another call out. Veteran and controversial rapper Idris Abdul Karim has called out Dibanj saying he has no talent but only has razzmatazz. He said it was stupid for Dibanj to have left on Jazzy because on Jazzy was the reason why many people listened to Dibanj's music. In a recent video that went viral online, Idris Abdul Karim said the biggest mistake Dibanj made was leaving Don Jazzy. You know why? Because Dibanj no get talent now only Razmataz in gets. Don Jazzy has the technical backup to produce a song that would make the band sound nice and I love him for that. And for the first time ever, DMW's Mayor Kuhn has kind of addressed his fans with regards to why his song Mama sounds a lot like Davido's Fall. Now Mayor Kuhn did say that his fans should not be too quick to judge because they don't know which song was recorded first. And because both songs were produced by the same producer, Kid Dominant, it is possible that his ideas rubbed off on both songs. Okay, and just before we go, Tiwa Savage Maven Queen has just dropped her EP titled Sugar Cane. It is a six tracker EP that uh, features producer Spells and Starboy Whiskey. It features her big hit all over and is all in preparation for a brand new album that drops in 2018, hopefully. That's all we have time for on Not Just a Kid News today. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure that you do the basics. Leave a comment in the section down below. Subscribe, like the video and check back for more. I'm Belarus Okoji and I'll see you next time.